Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a big haul for you and it is kind of random. So I basically shopped a little bit at several places. So I'm gonna just go through and show you everything that I got. I'm gonna start with Forever 21 because I have a sweater on today that I got there. So this one I paid $19.90 for. It is more of like a deep, deep eggplant maroon kind of a color. Um, it's kind of muted and I don't think the color's really picking up that well here, but it's a beautiful color. I love this portion of it because it really goes far back. So it almost looks like you have a thick banded choker on, but it is just part of the sweater. The only downside is you're almost guaranteed to get makeup on it if you're wearing makeup at the time. I do really, really love the look. And for $19.90, I thought it was a great deal. I got it in a zero X and I love it. It's a little oversized, so if you wanted it fitted, you could size down because I got it, I mean, 0X is what I normally wear and this is definitely an oversized one because I have lots of room. I also got two little headbands, just things to like put on to be cute. I got this one, which is like flowers, so cute. This one was $5.90, I think. I also got this one, probably more so for like I don't know going to work one day during the holidays this one was only $2.90 and it's basically you just see the big huge bow but I thought that would be cute and festive around the holidays to wear yeah it just looks like that it's like a big glittery bow on a headband I got this little notebook it's just like a plain spiral notebook it has a little bear and it says feed me and tell me I'm pretty this one was $3.90 I've just been like buying stationery lately like I've been kind of drawn to it Oh, and look how crazy my hair looks. Ooh, okay. And finally, I picked up that sweater in another color. This so it's kind of a mustard with a hint of green in it is how I would describe it. Um, because it's not really like mustard yellow chartreuse. Is that the color of this? But it's the exact same thing. So it's got the little choker collar and it looks like that. Also a 0X, 1990, same size and price. Next, I'm gonna show you what I picked up at Walgreens. I just have it in a little bin. So I was there looking for the Wet n Wild Halloween collection and I have been looking in the wrong place. So if you're going in and looking for it, it's in the Halloween section. Um, I didn't find everything, but I found a lot. And then something else caught my eye. So Beanie Boos, for some reason, always like, I see them and I'm like, oh, I need to get them because they're so cute with their big eyes. But look at this. I mean, maybe I'm a child at heart, I swear. But look how cute the dragon is. Oh my god. And then I couldn't stop there, so I got the little mummy. And I love that he's like coming undone right here. So cute. I think I showed this in my vlog too. And then I got the little ghost. He's holding a pumpkin and his little fangs are candy corn. How adorable. So I'll probably put them somewhere for like Halloween kind of decor. Two more of the liquid cat suits in the Halloween colors. So I got Widow's Peak which is the black and then Sleepy Hollow. So literally just a black and a dark gray. And I also found three of the paint palettes that they have. So this one is the Metallics, which has like a nice little range of colors. I got the Neutrals. This one's the one they have like the deer, I think is the picture. And then I got the Pastels, which they're using for like a unicorn look. But I figure when it comes time to do like crazy Halloween makeup at work, these are gonna come in handy and actually have some colors that are like meant to do what I'm trying to do. I also picked up a few things at Target. So I had seen these bralettes a couple weeks ago and could not resist. This is one of them that I got, which is like, oh, this, this color green is just so pretty. I think it's like a sagey green and the straps in the back are like this. I love the lace, it's very comfortable on, it's got, a little bit more like um, structure to it than your typical like cheap bralettes and it was only $12.99 so I thought that was a really good deal just love that I also got this one which is like a blush color and the detail on this one's so pretty so it's got like the higher neck this would be cute if you were wearing something where this was gonna show a little bit um, because it does go up pretty high really really cute and then the back of this one, some detail as well. So it kind of like crisscrosses in the back like that. I got another one of the e.l.f. HD under eye setting powders. I just wound up really liking this. So I wanted to, one of you guys suggested that, um, or told me that you always like picked up multiples and put them in a bigger container. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. I just got one, but I really like it. And then I saw that they had these candles on sale for $8. Um, they're the Signature Soy. So I got Heritage Pumpkin, which looks like this. 
that just smells so good. It just smells like Halloween, like Halloween and fall pumpkins with a little like spiciness to it. I got Autumn Harvest. I love the look of these two and the lids is really pretty. It's like a copper. That just smells like cinnamon, pumpkin, um, maybe a hint of apple in it too. That's just like really good. That one's probably my favorite. And then I got cinnamon apple cider. Mmm. It's just like perfect apple cinnamon. So I went to Bath and Body Works two separate times because one day they had a good deal on body products and then the next day they had a good deal on candles or a few days later. So this is what I got the first trip. I picked up this little loofah. I just couldn't resist. I want to take a really pretty picture with it. This was $4.50 which is kind of ridiculous for a loofah but it is gorgeous and right now I'm using like an Eco Tools one and they come apart so easily like they kind of suck. So I got that one. I got the bubble bath in the champagne apple honey and I love that it comes in this little bear. Oh my god I could not resist. These are a little pricey. This one's $16.50 and it's an eight ounce bubble bath but I mean you'll be able to use it many times. And then I also got in the champagne apple honey the body cream and the creamy body wash. So these I wasn't able to get the previous time that I went, so I just was really happy to pick those up. They were having to buy three, get three, and I had a coupon as well, so saved a little bit off of that. And then I got the um, Salted Caramel Apricot and the Body Cream. This one I've already been using and I love. They didn't have the creamy body wash, so I got this big shower gel, and I do like this container. And this one's bigger, $18.50, so it's pretty pricey. Um, so of course I paid for this one for sure because you're going to pay for the more expensive ones. But it is a good 10 ounce size so it's nice and big. And I never buy body mist but I love this salty caramel apricot so much that I actually got the fragrance mist in it as well. And what a pretty bottle. Like it's simple but I love the leaves. And the from. next time they had candles. Ooh! So I picked up four candles. They were doing... Two for 24 and then there was a 20% off coupon on Retail Me Not. If you guys don't use Retail Me Not, I definitely would. Like, this is not sponsored or anything, but I've been using them for years. Because um, if I'm going somewhere and I'm like, mm, I don't want to pay, pay full price, you can look and at least sometimes find a coupon. Most of the time, there's something you can use for Bath & Body Works, even if it's just like a free item. I got first the Spooky Sweets Scented Candle. It's just like, do so cute and it has this glittery lid how gorgeous is that and this one is caramel pumpkin swirl is the scent mmm god that smells like an amazing dessert I love the jar and like the little design on it is like skulls and cross bones I had to get a Halloween one I was just so tempted I got one more Halloween one this one is vampire blood which is Blood Red Strawberry, Midnight Blooming Jasmine, and Dark Transylvanian Plum. Mmm. Oh, that just smells so good, though. It's like berry. You can smell the berry of it. But it's also got, like, a richness to it. But this one's super cute, too. It's got, like, little, little skeletons and a mummy on it. And also has, like, a different pattern of the skulls and crossbones. Like, it almost looks floral until you look close. And it has, like, a spider lid on that one. Paid right at... It was $41 and change for four. And then I got leaves. And this one has like a, almost like a sweatery looking lid to it. Mmm. So leaves is this one. And I know everybody loves this. It smells like apple cinnamon, but there's something else to it. It's not just like straight apple cinnamon scent. There's definitely something in it that is different. Oh, but I love the way it and smells. And finally, I got the... Pumpkin Cupcake. And Pumpkin and Cupcake is Whipped Buttercream Madagascar Vanilla Pumpkin Spice Freshly Baked Cupcake. Ooh. Mmm. Yes, yeah, so it's just like another dessert. You just want to eat it. So all the candles I got in my mall, they just changed and like re... re they just like revamped the store. What's the, I'm looking for a word. You know, fixed it up. And they made it a white barn and they handed me a bunch of like boxes of matches, which was cute. She handed me like four boxes and she's like, these are for your candles. I was like, oh, that's such a nice touch. More things and everything else came from TJ Maxx. So I got this sweater, which was in my little ColourPop video, if that's already up. This is one of those like pink rose brand. And I just had to have something this color. It's like a perfect pumpkin color and it was only $16.99. This one is by Cable and Gage and this was $19.99. It's just black, but it's got like that really relaxed kind of collar, a little drawstring. And then on the side, which I hope it's gonna pick up, it's got little ties. 
going down the side but it's not open like it's got material like underneath it so it's not open it's still kind of warm and cozy material is just so so soft i got an extra large because i definitely wanted it to be a little big this shirt i could not resist it's um lauren by ralph lauren and this was only $19.99 it's a really good brand it, i got it in a large it's like a black t-shirt material but it's got like this brown suede zipper on one shoulder and then it's got brown elbow patches <sighs> so much I've been looking for something with elbow patches for a long time now and this was perfect because it's not like I didn't want something crazy looking I wanted it kind of plain and like the suede brown and it's Ralph Lauren too for $19.99 you can't beat it. I also picked up a pack of the measurable different scented soap petals and I've actually put them in a container this big set was $5.99 and then I bought this little glass jar for $4.99 so this is what I came up with I think it is so pretty and basically you just pop one of these roses in the bath which I saved like the not pretty ones like these are all very pretty and perfect those are kind of like eh. and so for $4.99 and $5.99 which is not a bad deal and you can actually use them in the bath but it's so pretty in the jar that I just couldn't resist and then I saw uh, this little pack which is coconut vanilla and it was only $3.99 for a smaller pack I saw a tiny caboodle and I couldn't resist it's a little bitty caboodle with little stars on it it comes with like this little can I say little like three more times please? It comes with this small like coin pouch. It's just like a little bitty thing. I said it again. Um, I might put like my cards in this possibly or I don't know what I'll do with that. And I could not resist this caboodle for $4.99. It just took me back to like I, it was probably 12 years ago. I had a caboodle and it was junky and like had nail polishes in it but I could not resist. Then I got another one of the Algis Algae Brightening Mask and this was on clearance for 10. I picked mine up for 20 and it was really nice because they're both like sealed in the little um, plastic protective thing that they have to undo at the register. I'm just going to put this directly in my next giveaway but I'm so excited. I used this the other night in a bath when I just like laid there and I loved it. My skin felt so nice smooth it looked brighter and it was like really hydrated and i have a whole bin of going in the giveaway i also picked up one of the makeup erasers this is the original one in red and this was only $7.99 they're normally around 20 so i thought this was a good deal i was hoping to find another one to put one in the giveaway but i only found one and i'm dying to try it out i also found the carez shampoo and this is the fine one i have really fine hair like people don't think that until they touch my hair and they're like "Ooh, that's like baby fine and i'm like yeah um so i have a lot of hair but it's really fine uh strands so i got this and it was on clearance for only three dollars and it was completely full but i always run out of shampoo first and this one has rice proteins and linden for thin or fine hair so I cannot wait to try that out. Finally, I got the Alginus Reveal Ultra Shine Anti-Aging Lip Gloss. And this was only $3.99. I don't know how old this is because honestly, I've never seen one. But it was completely sealed up. I'm going to put it a little on though and show you because it's really pretty. I have some Limp Plumper on but it's kind of like wearing off. It's a gorgeous lip gloss though. It's not sticky. It's creamy. And that's the Blushing Mauve. It doesn't really go with my eye. It's the Algoronic Acid, of course. It has microalgae oil, vitamin E, avocado oil, argan oil, and baobab something seed oil to help nourish and visibly smooth the appearance of lines on the lips. So that was everything in this haul. I know it was long. I'm sorry. Thank you for sticking around. I hope you enjoyed and be sure to leave a thumbs up if you like these types of hauls. Also be sure to subscribe if you haven't already because that giveaway is coming up very soon. Thanks for watching guys and I will see you later. Bye!